Yep, another episode involving the school of friendship, but this time it's on the Kuma, Kase Kuma Kaseya's intention, where they had to be part of the school of friendship, but at the same time, they really need to prove to everyone that they want to be part of the school of friendship, but now they are part of the school, but they're way, way too smart to become students. Now, when it comes to the school of friendship, they really want to be part of the students, but at the same time, they're in the situation where they want to do other things, like completely want to learn more about friendship. At the same time, they've got a lot of advices from that, from Lee, from their classes with Chell Lee. So, it's going to be very difficult for them to actually be part of a school. And when they try to be and when they try to be part of the school of friendship, it's really obvious that Twilight and the others really want no encounters with them because since that they also part of the school, it's really difficult for them to be in some kind of class because of how smart they are. So, they get into a very situation when they need to have a student, which is the first time we ever get to see Klausie grow, be part of an episode, yep, this is the first appearance we get to see this, where she actually wants to be part of the school of friendship because she actually knows a lot about friendship and learns so much. So the Kuri Marcuses decide to help her, however, after when they try to do the friendship test, this leads to a very, uh, another scene where we don't get an apology except it happens off screen which gets really redundant. But I'll get to that later. Let's talk about Krause Quo, which is the first time we ever get to see in this episode. She's just basically the typical, I want to hang out with so many people and want to do so many things in order to succeed at the school of friendship. But at the same time, she's just basically shy and she really doesn't know a lot about what she has to go through in order to become one of the students in the school of friendship. So, and when she completely failed her test, she decides to go to Starlight Glimmer in order to get some help about, in order to tell that the Kuma Kaseos are completely too smart in order to become students, and the fact that the Kuma Kaseos completely graduate even though that they didn't do much in the school of friendship besides, you know, wanting to be part of the school of friendship, they became told laws, told laws or whatever you call them. So they basically became teachers in the school of friendship because of how small they are. So they managed to become the school so they managed to be part of the school of friendship by becoming teachers. Really good for them considering the fact of how small they are and since they that they only have two mods, I think at this point there's really no point for them to becoming teachers. Although I feel bad for the teacher chill Lee that they're gonna be that she's going to be really a ship that she's going to be really upset that she's going to miss the Kuri Marcuses by a long shot. So much. But, let's get into the scene where they're completely banned from the school of friendship. Even though it wasn't the- even though that the Kuri Marcuses are just trying to help the Krause crow, I just think that it's just really ridiculous to see that Twilight is just completely furious at them since that they're responsible for this whole thing. Even though that she is respond, even though that she is the princess of friendship, and she can completely handle everything about of what that they can do, and seeing this like seeing them completely gain banned from the school of friendship with no apology, they've been doing this so many times that at this point, I think if I was in this situation, I wouldn't need to speak out and what's wrong with everybody without apologizing all the time. It's really getting old at this point. But, at the same time, they at least succeed by becoming the teachers. I mean, sure, the off-screen apologies is just getting old, but at the same time, it really works concerning the fact that they kind of succeed by becoming teachers. Even though there was not a single episode that we get to see these three becoming teachers, and I made a fanfic about it, maybe it could happen in Season 9, but we don't know for sure. So, I really think that this episode really does some good things, but at the same time, it's some things that are completely washed out the window, like the out, like the off-screen apology, for example. So, I really think that this episode really works out, considering the, the fact that I completely enjoy that the fact that the Kuya Marcuses have some encounters with the School of Friendship, and then at the end of the day, they became teachers instead of students, which makes everyone else wins, but even though they want to become students, but they really experience with the school of friendship. 
And besides, I think that what's going to happen in Season 9 involving these three characters, it's probably going to be really good to see what action that they have in Twilight School. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. I give this episode in 7 out of 10. Could have been better, but the off-screen apologies and the outburst is just really forced. And I, but I still like the, the appearance of Klausy Crow.